Okay. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to a new series we're doing on the channel. Resident Evil. Now, I'm not saying like Resident Evil as in like Resident Evil 2, Resident Evil 3, Resident Evil 4, Resident Evil 5, 6, you know, all that shit. No, no, no. Original Resident Evil. None of those things with the numbers at the end. Original Resident Evil. The very first one. This is the Resident Evil Remastered, but it's the original Resident Evil. Now, I tried to film this video like last night, but my video got corrupted and everything, which I hope it doesn't do this time. I'm like staring right at my fucking recording. It better not do it. I swear to God. I will squeal bloody murder at the end. And I will record that. <laughs> and you all will know why I did it. But, yeah. I am playing Resident Evil, and that's all I'm really going to say. Uh, I'll talk about more when we get into the game. All I know is that it's no Resident Evil with that other numbers at the end. It's just original Resident Evil. So I'm going to start a new game. Resident Evil. Ooh, I love that. Yeah, all this is going to be the same. Now, this... I, I, I went on like an entire tangent of everything uh, about this. I'll just make it short and sweet this time. Uh, like climbing a mountain and fulfilling takes a lot of work. You would think this would be a uh, hard mode. But in fact, this is normal. This is easy. And this is very easy. And since I actually didn't say this before, I've never played Resident Evil uh, before. The original, I have never played it before. Well, I played it. A bit. I wouldn't say I haven't played it before. I have played it before. Just, I never got to the first boss. So, we're going to be experiencing this together. You guys can help me in the comments and everything. And, you know, help me out. So, uh, yeah. What I'm going to do is, you might call me a pussy because I play, if you watch my Resident Evil 7 Let's Play, I play Resident Evil 7 on easy difficulty because of Jack. But this time, you would think I'll be going on normal, but normal and hard are basically the same. You have to have a strategy and everything. But like I said, I've never played this really much like before. Uh, so I am going to go on easy. Yes, I know. Grab your pitchforks. Call I'm a fucking shit Resident Evil player. I know I'm a Resident Evil professional, and yet here I am fucking playing on easy difficulty. But here's my here's my thing. Is that I've never played this before, so I don't know how I'm going to fare with this. You will see later in the video, once I save, that there will be a save uh, on the game. I never... I, that was my recording beforehand, but we'll talk about that later. So, yeah. <laughs> Approved. Yay! Alright, now here's another thing. Is that, ooh. Damn! Chris looking sexy. But, yeah, here's the thing. Do we want to play as Chris or Jill? Now, sorry, but I just, whew. all right. So, as much as I would like to play as Jill, for uh, obvious reasons, <clears throat> no, nah, but uh, the whole re I would play as Jill, but Jill is actually the easy one compared to, to Chris, because Jill has more inventory slots than Chris does, so I'm kind of gonna I'm kind of gonna balance it out by playing as Chris and not Jill to make it not super easy, but a little bit easy to kind of balance it out. And do I want to be playing as Soy Boy Chris or fucking man hunting, fucking you know beef eating Chris? Like I don't know what I was saying there because I'm tired, but I don't know. We're we're just gonna be playing as Chris. Uh, because to kind of balance it out. Chris Redfield. Let me let me say it and let me say it in the game as well. <clears throat> Chris Redfield. You know how like they did the Resident Evil, you know, Resident Evil Four, you know, and Resident Evil like Resident Evil. Alpha Team is flying around the forest zone, situated in northwest Raccoon City where we are searching for the helicopter of our compatriots, Bravo Team, who disappeared during the middle of their mission. Chris, you haven't found it yet? No, not yet, Brad. Bizarre murder cases have recently occurred in Raccoon City. 
There are outlandish reports of families being attacked by a group of about 10 people. Victims were apparently eaten. The Bravo team was sent in to investigate, but we lost contact. Look, Chris! Bravo team's helicopter was a derelict. Save for the remaining body of Kevin. We continued our search for the other members, and it turned into a nightmare. This way. There are only three STARS members left now. Captain Wesker, Jill, and myself. We don't know where Barry is. Is everyone all right? Barry. Where's Barry? He's... No. What was that? I'll go and check it out. All right. Jill and I will stay and secure this area. Chris? Take care. Yeah. All right. We're in the game now. Grab these ink ribbons. Now we just got a we just got a dainty little knife. Huh. You wanna square up? You wanna square up, my dude? You wanna square up? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm sorry, sorry. There's just something about it that made me laugh. All right, so here's what can happen. In this first episode, I did not know what to do. I only knew a bit. But since I already played it here. It's an old typewriter. You can save your progress. Use the ink ribbon. Yeah, I'm going to use an ink ribbon just to show you guys. So I played as Jill. That was on my own time. Uh, I only got for a bit. This is like the first thing I was playing as. And this is on normal difficulty. I think. <laughs> I'm not too sure. And this was the save file that I played on... 
uh, before uh, my last recording of this that failed. So we're gonna, just going to overwrite that. I got so far without saving at least once. But I have a feeling I won't be that lucky this time. Alright, let's do this. There's a blood stains on the floor. Hope these didn't come from your friends. No! Now I would grab I would grab this. This right here. I will grab this. But I don't know what it's for yet. So we're just gonna leave it for the time being. We're just gonna leave it. I grabbed it last time, but I didn't know what it was for, so we're just gonna assume. Oh no! Ah, you! J ah! He's gonna eat me alive! We're just gonna, we're just gonna, we're just gonna leave him alone. I'm not gonna, even gonna try to fight him. I'm just gonna run away like a damn pussy. Ah, mommy! Ah! <laughs> it just starts running around in circles. It's like I'm terrified for my life. Wesker? Jill? Where did they go? Oh no. I don't know whose gun that is, but it's bad. Will you take the handgun? Nah, I'm good. I'll just slice every enemy in my path. Just start slicing them. Bitch, yes, I want to take the handgun. We take the handgun? Yes. Alright, I guess we'll equip it. Alright. Before we do anything, I want to go down here and hear this moan. You might be like, yeah, Andrew, that's gross, but just watch, just listen. wonder what's on the other side of this door. Death, Chris. It's death. There are, oct there are octangle indentations to the right and left of the door. Chris, death's behind that door. <laughs> Alright. Alright, we're just gonna go this way. For some reason, I'm not breathing. Will you take the dagger? Yes, please. Emergency evade. Using defense items such as daggers will allow you to escape momentarily when grabbed by an enemy. However, you will not be able to escape the enemy gra when, when the enemy grabs you from behind. To equip a defense item, go on to the status screen and then select an item from the defensive item menu. And then select the equip command. If your defense item mode is set on manual, your controller settings, you must press L2 to use defense item. Alright. Oh no! Didn't even use the defense item, but I wasted bullets. Oh shit, he coming. There's a map of mansion one floor. One F, take it? Yes, take the map! 
And in my first playthrough, I thought where the t where they have the typewriter circled, I thought that was a noose for a second. Like, when I first played this game, I'm over here like, what the hell? It's like, there's a noose in a room? It's like, what are you trying to do? You have the map of Mansion 1-4. Okay. Cool, 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 cool. Now we run! Head upstairs. Let's head upstairs. All right. Now we do it. Wait. It's locked. I think all these doors up here, besides uh, that big one, if my memory serves me correct from yesterday, I believe all the doors here are locked except that one. That big door. So I assume we just... Damn! Hold up, we gotta. Mm hmm. The ass is on fleek. Oh gosh, look at this. Look how. So, for a second, I saw a spot. I saw a spot. I thought I saw. Whoa, bruh. That was bright. I'm blinded now. Damn, look at the freaking. Look at this. God, it's so. It's so good. It's like, look. You can't make anything out through the darkness and fog. Really? Not even the other Chris that's sitting on the other side that looks like a mirror? An old painting of a lar in a large frame. It's been well preserved and the people in, in it are still... Are still... Vividly... Vividly... Depicted. This is probably going to be the most annoying part of this game, is the doors. <laughs> I mean, it's, loading doesn't take forever, but you know what I'm saying. Hey! How you doing, bud? How you doing? Can I kill you? Do I want to waste my ammo? Six bullets, yeah. Oh no. Well, we just saw something, so now we do what any what any brave and mature individual would do. Mommy! <laughs> it's stained glass window. The pattern is the scent in the center resembles a woman. Mommy! <laughs> okay, I think I'm, I think I'm good. It's locked. I'm over a sword. Okay. It's locked from the other side. Ooh. <laughs> Bitch, I got another dagger. If you want to come at me after I just shoved a dagger in your brain. I'm going to shove another dagger in your brain. Can I just jump down? I don't know. Obviously, Chris is a soy boy, so he's not going to be hes not gonna be like, I'm going to jump down. He's not going to be like, ah, that's what I'm going to do. I'm not going, I'm not going to uh, jump. I'm not going to jump down. I'm going to walk down the stairs like a pussy. <laughs> what was that? Bro, this game makes me feel things. I don't know, maybe it's because, like, there's no dialogue or anything. And it's just me talking to myself. Will you take the blue gemstone? Yes. Alright, let's head back in this room. And I believe the Well, hello there. How are you doing this fine evening? Good. No. Oh, it's horrible. The wife cheated on you? With another man? Oh, damn it. Oh, no, not another man. A, a woman? She was a lesbian the entire time? Oh, I feel so bad for you. I know, bro. It's horrible. 
Did you get your revenge or anything? Did you tell her that you're done? No? You said you wanted a threesome. That's crazy, bro. Really? So did you get it? Oh no. She didn't want she didn't want that, so she decided so she, she decided to break up with you because you asked. Oh god, god, that's gotta be rough, bruh. You know, give me a hug. Oh no, okay, he 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 looks vicious. He's, oh, he's coming at me violently. Oh, give me a hug, bruh. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> stay back, <laughs> stay back. The corpse of your comrade Kenneth. It looks like he's holding something. It's film that belonged to Kenneth. It's a, in the video play of this, he was reported on it. The corpse of your comrade Kenneth. It looks like his throat's been torn out. God, I feel so bad for my bud Jer Jerry back there. I feel so bad. The wife shouldn't have done that to him. The wife shouldn't have shouldn't have done that. What is this? Will you take the handgun magazine? Yes, please. Now I believe I know this. Alright. And I may be a freaking old bastard here, but but in Re in the Resident Evil games, um, for some reason they did not do it in Resident Evil Four, is you can go in here and click combine, and uh, it says you can't combine items because I already reloaded. But you go in here, click combine, and you have to combine it with your gun. That's how old-fashioned Resident Evil games used to do that. Or you could just do what I just did and aim and click circle. Well, that's what I did. Anyways, you're going to come back to life. I know it. Do I want to try? Okay, good. You stay dead. I don't know. I was like, should I try? Man, look at these camera angles. Wow, these are perfect camera angles. Wow, really act activates the spooky stuff. I'm totally not being sarcastic. Oh, damn. Damn, look at the mirror. Oh, you gotta make sure that the butt's on fleek. Ooh, yeah. That's beautiful. Here we get... What you doing? Bro, the wife the wifey said you didn't have to be in the corner anymore. She said you were fine. I know you don't have to cry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Oh shit. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to. I mean I kinda meant to. What's in here? This hurt me. No, it doesn't. Okay. Guess I could have demonstrated it. Alright. Now, if you're playing this for the first time, do not take this key. May whoever takes the emblem, this emblem, find peace in death. Would you like to take the mansion key? No, because what I've learned is that if you do it, it's a trap. And it'll kill you. It's locked. Memo of a helmet. Mm. Damn. God, my tailbone hurts. Ah, I didn't say butt bone this time. No! Oh. oh no. Buddy, calm down. You don't have to do this. Alright, I'll demonstrate it. Look, see? Combine. See? That's something you cannot do in Resident Evil 4. I'll demonstrate. I demonstrated it. Will you take the golden arrow? Yes, please. 
Yeah, we all know that. And I'll take this too. It's the handgun magazine. I think. Okay, I unlocked it. I don't know where it goes to. Let's lock them on the other side. I don't know what this goes to. That's the problem. That's the issue. I don't know what it goes to. I forgot. Oh, it takes me right back out here. Oh, okay. Is he still dead up here? Is Jerry still dead? Oh, my God. He's still dead. No. All right. But before you do anything, let us examine this. Because this is something you have to do in the old Resident Evil games. You don't... It doesn't... You don't just, like, get something. It's like, huh, this part can be removed. Would you like to remove it? No, 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 no. You have to actually manually do something like that. Because, see, you have to... The arrowhead looks like it can be removed. Arrowhead. The arrowhead is made of a paradox, sometimes referred to as a poor man's emerald. And there we go. Because we need that for a puzzle. The puzzles are already starting. Oh, my God. I know. Torture. Now, I did not know this when I first played it. I just guessed. But apparently, this was a door. I'm over here like, I'm over here like, what is this? And then I opened it, and it's like, what? Why am I looking at it? Because it waits for a bit. And then I'm like, oh my god, it's a, it's a door. Are you serious? And I'm like, that's crazy. A crumbling tombstone. There is no name in, or inscription. Are these shotgun shells? I forgot. Can't carry any more items. Of course, because I'm freaking Chris. God, I knew he should have been aborted. I'm kidding. Chris is cool. But, you know. Now he's like this. So now, tomb engraved with a picture of an angel. There is an indentation in the shape of an arrowhead. Oh, yeah. It doesn't. I uh, forgot. It also, if you examine some, you have to manually do it itself. I'm just teaching all you youngins. Of how Resident Evil games used to work back then. I'm just teaching all you youngins. Who hasn't played a Resident Evil game. Like one of the old fashioned ones. Back then. It wasn't like. You look at some. And it's like. Oh I can put that there. No no no. You have to actually use your brain. A stone with, statu with a, a, st a stone statue. With a hole where the eye should be. Oh, that's creepy. Hey. Stone statue with holes where the eyes, nose, and mouth should be. Yeah, that one's the freaky one. No, you won't be able to smell anymore. Stone with the hole where the nose should be. Stone with the hole where the mouth should be. Ugh, this one's the freaky one. This one's like a skeleton. Ugh. A book fitted perfectly in the indentation. Would you take the book of curses? Miss Please. I thought that was anyone gonna fall. Now let's examine this. Because if you look behind it, da 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 da! There's a key Im embedded on the on the back cover. Will you remove it? Yes, please. And we got the mansion key. Book of Curses. Book of Curses. The four masks. Ooh, ominous. A, m a mask that speaks no evil. A mask that smells no evil. A mask that sees no evil. A mask that cannot speak, smell, or see evil. When all fall into place, evil will awaken. That's ominous. Now, if we take a good look at this key. What key is it? It's the sword key! Okay, cool. Didn't forgot about that. We got the sword key. For some reason, I always thought that the uh, armor key was first. For some odd reason. I don't know why. I always thought the armor key was first. But no, it's the sword key. For like the longest time, I thought it was the armor key that was first. But no, it's the sword. We know perfectly... My throat just basically ate shit. We know perfectly where to put this. If we go deep, it's locked from the other side. Of course it is. Oh, my back. Oof. You're like a professional massager. 
And no, not with those from the, those websites. No. You can use the mansion key. I believe this is the one where... Uh, this is the room where you go into and there's a save point. Maybe? Was I lying? I think I may have been lying. I was lying. <laughs> I was lying. There's something in there that I don't want to check out. He's just like, Arr. it's like, oh my god. Wait, no, 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 no. wait. I'm talking from the other side. No, 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 no. I don't remember what door it was. It was a door with a save room. I don't remember what door it was, though. Can I jump down here? No, I cannot. Chris doesn't want to break his little fragile boy legs. I forgot what door it was. Maybe it was the one right next to this. Right here? Or no? So, no, it's off from the other side, obviously. Door? It's locked. Armor. Use the mansion key. Maybe this was the door that I was thinking of. There was one door that had a save room. Yep, this is the room. It's locked. Armor. Great. Great again. Wow. I love these. Wow, it sounds like the Resident Evil 4 doors. Wow. What is this? Can't carry any more items. Yeah, I think it was right here. Yep, it was. Ooh! Did I scare you? <laughs> I wasn't trying to, but it sounded like I tried to scare. <clears throat> yep, here's the save room. I'll just grab this real quick. Oh. Special instructions for the disposal of dead bodies. We have new information regarding those beings. They may appear to be dead, but in fact, they are able to come back to life. However, there are ways to prevent them from be becoming active again. Currently, there are two known methods to cease their reconstruct re re reconstruction. Uh, Insintegration. Um, destruction of the head. If further methods are discovered, you will be notified immediately. Meanwhile, to those who are still who still have... The will to live. Oil is placed on the first floor of the mansion. Take as much as you need. You'll need something to light it with. Would you have to find it yourself? I will some, let's do something real quick. 32. That's actually good. Let's open this and let's... Ooh, wow. We, are, we got some ink ribbons in here. Actually, we'll need that. I don't know if we'll need this right now. Um... Let's put the knife away. I don't know if we'll need that. You take the fuel canteen. If and if we there's a plenty of uh, kerosene left. To fill your fuel canteen. You fill the uh, fuel canteen with kerosene. And only filled up by two! Well, we have a lighter, so. Alright, let us save our progress. Oh, will you take the old key? Sure, I guess. With an old typewriter. Yep. Save your progress. The ink ribbon. Storeroom. Alright. And now I'm going to put the ink ribbon back, and we will end off the video.
video. So yeah, this is the first part of Resident Evil. So yeah, hopefully you all enjoy will enjoy this series um, of Resident Evil. So yeah, hopefully you all enjoyed. And peace, demons out. Please do not be corrupted when I click you. Please, I swear to God. Peace, demons out. Goodbye.